So let's see the answer. So first you are writing the given y equal to cot inverse and here root 1 minus sin x divided by 1 plus sin x. So here 1 minus sin x and 1 plus sin x if I do the rationalize or uh, then there that come 1 minus sin x and here this is equal to cos x. So it doesn't make any sense to resolve this problems. If I do like this it will be a more lengthier. So the next is here we know cos x equal to sin pi by 2 minus x. So this formula is there and hereafter we can write sin x equal to cos pi by 2 minus x. So in place of sin we can write cos. Okay. So after that it's uh, too easier to solve the problems. So now here we can write 1 minus uh, sin x plus cos. So 1 minus here cos pi by 2 minus x and the next is here on the denominator 1 plus cos pi by 2 minus x. Now 1 minus cos x that is equal to 2 sin s square x by 2 and for 1 plus cos x that is equal to 2 cos s square x by 2. So that here going to uh, use that formula y equal to cot inverse then after 1 minus cos that is equal to 2 sin s square pi by 2 minus x. So here pi by 2 and divide by 2 is there and in the denominator 2 cos s square pi by 2 minus x divide by 2. This 2 to cancel after that this we can write y equal to cot inverse here. So sine by cos we can write tan s square and then after it has the same terms so this is now pi by 4 and minus x by 2. Now s square that to remove the root so this is now cot inverse so there I can get cot so this uh, root remove the s square remove the root so this is now tan pi by 2 minus x by 2. Now after that to uh, here cot inverse so we know cot inverse cot theta that is equal to theta so we need to convert this one into a uh, cot form so for this here we can write uh, tan 90 minus theta that is equal to cot theta okay and here cot 90 minus theta that is equal to tan theta so this formula we know so now we can write y equal to cot inverse and then after here so this place we can write cot 90 and then after minus theta so here this is now pi by 4 and this minus multiplying then this become uh, x by 2 okay and uh, here this terms <coughs> so now after that uh, if you do further calculations so pi by 2 right there and this is now here minus and this here in the bracket so this is now so cot 90 this suppose this is all is the theta so cot 90 minus theta that is equal to tan theta okay so that here that you get this terms and after or doing the simplification cot inverse cot minus multiplying so this is now here pi by 2 minus pi by 4 and here minus minus plus x by 2 now after that cot inverse cot theta and suppose this all is the theta so that come theta so y equal to pi by 2 minus pi by 4 
and here plus x by 2 okay so now let's do the differentiation so not going to calculate dy by dx here d pi by 2 divided by dx and here d pi by 4 divided by dx and 1 by 2 is there here dx by dx so this constant term the value comes 0 here 0 and this is now 1 by 2 into 1 so thereafter dy by dx that come here 1 by 2 so this is the answer of this questions so one time going to repeat this all so here uh, we know this so uh, if I do like this rationalize then I can struct there so here after I just converted this sin x into cos and uh, after that uh, we know this two formula put that and then you can get here cot inverse tan square pi by 4 minus x by 2 now you can get here tan so tan and we know cot inverse cot theta equal to theta so there is the tan and cot is there so 1 by cot it doesn't back any sense after that we need to reverse so after that here we know cot 90 minus theta that is equal to tan theta so here just write in place of tan cot here this is now pi by 2 and minus and this is here theta so cot 90 minus theta that is equal to tan theta so this is equal now after that do the simplification minus multiply cot inverse cot theta that is equal to or theta so this all right after doing the calculation then you can get 1 by 2 so this is the way we can do the differentiation of this question so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you